guys welcome back okay so today i wanted to go ahead and do another quick unboxing of the latest trend mood box i was able to snag it get my hands on it and this is her collab with nabla and there were a few items that she showed and i was like i think i want to try that okay so let's go ahead and open up this box now the trend mood box if you're not aware is a box that Trend Mood comes out with basically <laughs> whenever she feels like it. There's no rhyme or reason or schedule or anything like that. She'll just kind of, you know, put teasers up and stuff on Instagram just to kind of get everybody, you know, a little tingly and say, okay, I'm collabing with this company or doing this kind of box. You'll see that on Instagram and then it's kind of like save the date or sign up for notifications because actually you don't really know when it's coming out so that's what the trend mode box is it's not like a regular monthly subscription it's one that you kind of have to look out for and you can pick and choose it's kind of cool because you might want this one and you might not want that one so you know i decided to go ahead and grab this collab with nabla so let's go ahead and see what we got Okay, so this first item here is a mascara. It's called Major Pleasure Mascara, okay? This is what the box looks like. And let's see what the actual mascara looks like. Oh, this is cute. So it's in kind of like a light tan packaging. Nice size mascara as well. Very, very cute, easily able to pick this out from your other mascaras as well i don't have any mascaras in packaging this color okay and that's what the wand looks like looks kind of like your basic standard mascara wand it's not too big and bushy though which i don't like because i tend to make a mess with those but it looks like it's just big enough to really add some extra volume and length so yeah, really excited about trying this out. I'm really happy. I got a couple of new mascaras to try out. Well, I got quite a few actually because I bought the little sampler kit from Sephora that my girl DJ was raving about. So <laughs> I bought that and I bought this and I got a milk mascara in my BoxyCharm. So I got a lot of nice new mascaras to try you guys. So this is really cool. And this box I think was $48. So... More pricey than the e.l.f. one, of course, but you do get some really nice things in here. So next, it looks like there is a brush set in here. And the little holder for the brushes is really pretty. Very pretty, kind of like gold and burgundy tone to it. Very cute. And the little tab here for the zipper, it says Nabla. I know that's upside down. Let's see here. Okay, <laughs> it says Nabla. So let's check these brushes out. And I like for the bag, the inside is gold. So it's really, really pretty. Really pretty if you like that type of stuff. I know most people aren't really traveling right now. So, you know, I don't know how far you're really taking your makeup and your brushes, but cute little holder. So this is what the brushes look like. I'm going to go ahead and take them out. And they are all individually wrapped. And you can see they have a really, really pretty red handle. Let me take these out right quick. Okay, you guys. So I got all of the brushes out of each of their individual sleeves. And this is what the brush set looks like. Very, very pretty. Kind of like red see-through plastic handle. A nice pretty gold ferrule. And it looks like this is an eight piece. And you also get, you know, a dual ended brush with the spoolie on one side and angled brush on the other. But these are really, really pretty. A nice eye brush set. So let me see the detailing here. Okay, and it does have brush numbers on here. I don't know if you guys will be able to see that, but it has Nabla and it has the number of the brush as well as, you know, the gold ferrule. So that's what they look like. Last thing I needed was some more brushes, but these are really, really pretty. Okay, so next here we have the Nabla Ruby Lights. This is a glitter palette and that's what the packaging looks like. And this is really, really pretty. 
I really like the packaging on this glitter quad because it's see-through. It just looks really, really pretty because you can see the glitters in there are really gorgeous and I like it because it's clear. It just has kind of like a nice, really pretty, sophisticated look to it. So this is what the glitters look like. Gorgeous, gorgeous shades in there. I'm not like a big glitter freak or anything like that. I don't hate glitter, but you know, when I see a pretty glitter, <laughs> it does kind of tempt me. But these are really, really pretty. I like the shades that are in here. Of course, I'm not swatching this because swatching glitter is a hot mess, especially when you're not about to use it. No. <laughs> so yeah, that's what that looks like. Really pretty. And lastly, in this box, we did get a new Nabla palette. This is the side-by-side -side nude palette from Nabla. And it is new, I believe. I don't know, you guys. I've really, really just been exploring different nude, neutral palettes and stuff. I don't know. They're just really getting me right now. But I'm pretty much at my limit. I think I've had my feel of neutral palettes for a while. But this one is really, really pretty. Let me show you what it looks like. There is a mirror in here. And these are the shades in this palette. Now, I will admit, I do have a few Nabla palettes already. And I haven't really been all that amped to use them, but I definitely need to try them out because, you know, some people really like them. Some people say they're just okay. I haven't developed my own opinion yet about their palettes. So this one's really pretty. I think probably the first Nabla palette that I will try will be the Berry one because I haven't used that yet, but we'll see. So this is the palette that we got, and I think it's really pretty. It's very nice quality, um, and I think it's a gorgeous neutral palette, to be honest with you. Some really pretty shimmers in here, too, so that is it. So I really am happy <laughs> about this box. I think what I'm most excited about trying is probably the mascara, which is kind of weird, but yeah. I really want to try out this mascara. The palette is really pretty. The glitter palette is really, really pretty as well. And who doesn't like a really pretty festive brush set around the holidays? So yeah, happy about the box. Glad I picked it up and just wanted to share it with you guys. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and hit that like. And I will see you on my next video. Doodle.